I'm being silly. You can't come with me. But, um, I admit when I opened it, I started daydreaming about how amazing our adventure would be together. But I know you couldn't leave Ace and uh, just forget that I said it. Trina, you know how much I love you. And I never want you to think that I'm prioritizing Ace over you. I don't. After everything that we've gone through together. But Esme's moved out and she is Ace's primary caregiver. I mean, I don't think he'd fly away. And I could fly back on weekends as long as Esme would let me see him. Wait a minute. <laughs> what are you saying? I'm saying that when the woman you love invites you to go to Paris, you say yes. <laughs> you were at All Saints. It's just so wrong. You have to bring yourself. I don't know what you think you heard, but well, it wasn't. More than enough. You know, Drew Kane and I became friendly while we were in Bentonville. He saved my life, actually. And after he was attacked, I was able to return the favor. Drew had a very hard time inside. All he wanted to do was to get back to the woman he loved, back to the woman he sacrificed his freedom for. Carly Spencer, formerly Carly Parenthos, your husband's ex-wife, the mother of the children. You're a hypocrite. That's what you are. You listen to my confession? How could you be so dishonest? I thought I was talking to a man of God. You were. Just as you are now. So, Nina, how can I help you? I tell me what that was about. Yeah, I told Matt what I thought about him for obvious reasons. Good, because I was announced. Oh, but please, just don't be soft. I mean, he's not worth it. And I need something stronger than this. Michael? It's New Year's Eve. I don't want to talk about it. They did. It's not over before you don't make it. Ned, you had an agreement. If Sonny thinks that Ned harmed Carly, he's not going to let it go. He's going to finish it. Now what's going on with those two? Why are we talking about a young kid? I thought Michael was trying to push Ned out. Quite the opposite. Ned has been taking on more responsibility. Hey, Michael's even given him his proxies. You see, he's all good. Wait a second. What? Michael handed over his control of ELQ. Why would he do that? Why do you care? I swear you always do this because you get something in your head and then you can't leave it alone. Like the time your mother was planning that surprise party for you for months and you ruined it. Okay, okay, okay. Did Michael do this to keep Ned quiet? Turn his own mother into the SEC. 